Uh, you didn't enter today, did you? No. I did. How'd, go? How'd you do? I'm um, one, two, out. Damn. Already out. Kazuya Mishima, kill him. Dude, like, I had to play against Dre round one. Oh. And he played Steve. And, like, I. The set was good. It was yeah. a good set. Like, I, I almost won at the end. It was 2 1. Mm -hmm. But I, I couldn't clutch it out. He just had a better last stock than I did. Uh huh. And then I just lost to, like,. Uh, God, who did I lose to? That Ness player? Oh, uh, yeah, Gray. Cast for yeah, Gray. Yeah, jumping right into jumps and Spot, though. This is a matchup I've been wanting to see for quite a while now. Ever since uh, Spot's rise to the top here in Senko, I've always wondered how my boy Jump's going to do against him. Yeah. So this is going to be the test. Yeah, Um. so the biggest uh, question when you're playing against Steve matchup is how you can break blocks. How do you deal with blocks? And I think Lucas has a pretty good tool. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, no! Oh, blocks, though! That... Mm, that's uh, kind of a that's kind of that's just a, a rough thing you gotta deal with in this matchup. Yeah, that's a I, I ain't gonna lie to you. If that happened to me, I'd be tilted. I'd be mad. I'd be super mad. I'd be a little tilted from from the get go. Yeah, but like you were saying, I do think Lucas has some pretty good ways of dealing with blocks, at least on stage. Yeah, he's got really uh, far-reaching, safe, disjointed no, uh, aerial normals. He's got the gay fire. Zare. Zare. Yeah. yeah. And he's got the movement to, to mix up Steve, even if he decides to jump above him over yep. the blocks. Also, um, he does, I believe, so yeah, he does have the uh, the wood bat, the reflector, so yeah. Minecraft comes out. Oh, that's a setup. You're not dead yet, not quite. Ooh, air dodges right through the minecart, good stuff. Air dodges the grab as well. Yeah, but that's not, that's not true stuff, as true as it looks. It's sometimes. not as true as it looks, you're right. So that, that spot showing that he knows more about some weird matchups than we think he does. Pull up that wall. Get those resources. It seems like it seems like Rick also knows this matchup plenty. Cause yeah, I'm sure he knows it more than I, I would think because of how much Wi-Fi he plays and mm -hmm. uh, the interactions he has in Discord and all that. Uh, I know he's already part of the Steve Discord. He's learned a lot about the character. Uh -huh. Not enough to want to play him, thankfully. But <laughs> <laughs> no, imagine, imagine Rick on Steve. Though. Dude. Imagine, imagine someone with the creativity like Rick to be like playing Steve. Like, imagine Rick or like Parker playing Steve too. Like, oh, oh no. my god, dude! Stop. Disgusting. What a good rollout from a uh, spot. Oh, yeah. I didn't think. I didn't think about PK freeze in this matchup. To be honest, that, I don't seem like I have that. No, option. it doesn't seem like that bad of an option to use. But you have. It seems like you're gonna have to use it smart because, like we see here, it does prevent him from. Uh, it does prevent him from. Uh, getting the resources that he wants to get, but at the same time, it puts Lucas in a pretty vulnerable uh, position where if Steve decides to go aggressive, you're probably going to get punished. Yeah. Diamond back air, man. That's just a wall of just kill power that you just cannot get past. Yeah, I need to straighten that out. I was messing with it. Uh, My bad. Spot's got jumps off stage now. Gets, fights his way back on. And we're back to the neutral game. Diamond makes Steve just... I think like Steve without Diamond is a great character, but once you put Diamond into the mix, top ten. Yeah, top ten character in the game with Diamond, no question. Oh yeah. There's a pretty bad spot that jumps us in here. Last stock, 92% already, but fighting his way back in. He's a little bit of Uh oh. That's some subpar DI on the dash attack. Hey, but Steve no longer has uh, Steve no longer has a pickaxe though. That is true. No, no more pickaxe, so no more throw to back air for now. Yeah. With a little bit more percent, though, the threat of any any material is going to kill you from mid-screen, yeah. even at this percent. Yeah, Spot's just trying to get as many resources as he can here before he is forced to make a new pickaxe. Yeah. Probably going to try and get he the kill with a, a minecart or a sword move. He has, he has another set of diamonds. I think he's just waiting for... Just in case. The Jumps thing, just yeah. gets, gets the stock. He doesn't want to waste the diamond. Down smash. Ooh, Ooh, almost. Small Elytra. Oh, oh no! This is why we hate multi hits. We hate multi hits in this household. <laughs> well, he parried the he parried the first hit. Exactly, and then he just jumped right back into yeah. the other ones because that can happen because the hitbox doesn't go away if you parry one. Nope. But why does Link's up B hit work like that? If you block one hit of Link's up B, the rest of it goes away. Why? I don't know. Not even Young Links works like that. Actually, no, that's not true. I think all the Links work like that. But, like, it feels like they're the only ones. Where if you parry or block the multi-hit, it just stays there. Yeah. It's it's weird. We're going to see the Woo! snake pick. Okay, okay. All right, so I know I know for a fact Spot has some great experience mm -hmm. in the snake matchup. Definitely. With Art, with, uh, I don't give a fuck what she doing. I don't give a fuck what she doing. But, but this character is just, in, in general, much more widespread than Lucas is. Mm -hmm. Um... But, at the same time, Snake is a much better character than oh, Lucas. Yeah. Also, it doesn't help that that Rick on, a, on Snake is 
much different than Arlock Snake. Much, Arlock's, much different. Arlock Snake is a very calculated, very, very standard, crop of the mill, but like, fundamentally sound mm -hmm. snake. Jumps is much more about the setup potential and the creativity behind Snake and yep. and, and cooking grenades for as long as possible and, and always getting that C4 stick. Only thing, my only concern here now is that Jumps has been spending a lot more time with Lucas specifically because he feels like his Lucas has kind of fallen off of a snake. Mm -hmm. um, so he hasn't been playing snake nearly as much. But the st his skill is still there. I think he can still definitely make oh, yeah. this happen. It'll just be hard. We're already seeing ah. a... Oh! Oh, and the back air! Yep. Yep. I, I was just going to say, we're already seeing a better start here from Jumps to begin with. We we'll already have a lot more percent off on spot than he did in the last game. But that that's a big momentum sw uh, swinger right there. Taking that first stock. Also, spot... Oh, I have to C4. Oh, <laughs> that was disgusting. Jump him ledge stick. He said, yo. Insta oh, stick my. and the pop and the up air just for the flare. Yep. Like, he got another C4 on him. Jumps is so good at getting that stick. Did he just parry? Yeah, he just parried. That... That's the most alpha chat thing you can do <laughs> against Snake. And another one. Another okay. stick. Waits for the uh, for the side B. Gets the uh, damage from the C4. I've played against Rick so much. I, get, I see I see him do a setup. I'm like, he's gonna go for he's gonna go for something in the forward air. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm That's what he does, man. He lives for those forward air spikes. Nice pair hey! together, and this, there it is. We were just <laughs> talking about it. Stick. There's the stick as well. He's so good. He's so creative with these sticks. Oh, oh my god! No! no! He at least a stock trade. Come on! Not quite getting that though. No. My cart. <laughs> oh, cool. And there's the up tilt. Uh. We even things up here. This is still in the realm of possibility for jumps to I, make happen. Yeah. I think I think special was a. Was a fantastic Great choice. choice. Yeah, definitely. Forces Snake, forces Steve to brawl, and that's what that's what Jumps wants. Mm -hmm. He wants to brawl. He wants to fight. Mm -hmm. He says, "Grenades in my hand. Let's go." Grenades are so strong on this stage when you put them on that platform because they can hit underneath it. Yep. And there's so so much pressure. It forces it just prevents you from from even coming close to that platform at all. Oh, Spot is getting hit by a lot more stray uh, grenades than I thought he would be. Oh, oh I almost killed. Steve is mighty light. Oh, he's got the entire set of the grenade the in the house. <laughs> <laughs> he's crafting. He's building. Snake really is the police. Ooh. Oh, 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 no! Oh, 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 what? 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 No, 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 jumps to that. Yeah. Jumps to that. Jumps took that game with the Anto. Oh my God, we're going to game three. Let's go. We're going to get someone clip that. Wow. Someone clip that. Peter, clip that. <laughs> <laughs> That was phenomenal. He jumps, died to the minecart hit, but he got the frame six up till out in oh time, and that has so much <laughs> knockback. It's just, it was not even close. Spot just got went straight to the top blast, blast zone. We got lucky, no star KO. We're going straight to game three now. I have no star KO, no. Dude, if it was a star KO, jumps would have lost. I would be tilted. Jumps one through oh, RNG. Oh no! So, mm, okay. Small battlefield's kind of a rough one. Oh yeah, Steve is so good on small you're, battlefield. You're forced to either take him to PS2 though. PS2 or small battlefield. I would take him PS2 over to small battlefield. Really? Why? What's the difference? Uh, so because of the platforms being they're a little, little lower, just like battlefield is. Um, Steve has some crazy TNT setups on that, on that platform. Really? Yep. Only that has of, that much of an effect on the matchup. Yes. Wow. Not, not, so like, not. if he plays the TNT on the left platform here at the edge, and I do neutral get up. Well, I get so, hit. So we, well, yeah. So you, yeah. So he puts, so he puts it on the far end where the corner, of, where the ledge is. Mm -hmm. Puts the TNT down, drops down, up tilt. If you, you can, oh yeah, because it activates up tilt and it's smaller for him because he explodes it. Oh, that's yeah, ridiculous. Yeah, and then did he not do that on PS2? Um, it's no because the platform is a little too high. high. Just wow. a little too high. Wow. Yep. I did not realize that changed anything. Yep. Yeah, because I let Drago here earlier. I banned PS2 against him. Yeah. I banned PS2 in Smashville, and he brought me here, and I lost. Yeah. Damn, I gotta keep that in mind. Yeah. And if, if, if you usually get up shield, shield break. Ooh, that was a rough oh, yeah. there. It's all right. 100% on, on spot here. This is definitely yep. kill percent for Snake. Yep. Up to, that's up to range. 100%, yeah. Steve could get something started, though, real quick and get a quick 60 on his uh, his side as well. I'll hold on. I'll hold hey, on. Here it is. Hey, 60% right there. He's my Oh my god, he he, he breaks the cipher. Wow. Wow. That's the matchup knowledge. We'll see what jumps can do to get around this one. We are not looking great here. We got a mountain to climb. Yep. 
With diamonds on deck, too. Mm -hmm. He already has diamonds as is. And he's got another one set up for next stock. Yeah. Yeah, I, I don't think a spot really minds getting tagged by a grenade mm -hmm. or two off ledge, but that Nikita is going to take that second stock, uh, first stock off spot. Yeah. Diamonds incoming. Only 25% here for uh, jumps. That's not a lot for Snake. No. Character is mad heavy. Good roll away from the minecart. Ape combo. Ooh, that coming to four down. Combo. Oh, he's cooking. He combo. He Hold on a sec. He's crafting, bro. He's got that automatic iron farm going. <laughs> I hate Steve combos on Twitter. Uh oh, yeah. Ooh, good for combo. Oh, oh my god. No tech on that block though. A little bit too fast. There. Hey, when we said Steve, when we said. Uh, jump is a lab monster. Oh, oh, he didn't quite make it. Damn, you hate to see that. Yeah. That'll be spot taking that set 2-1 over jumps. Valiant effort put it put in there by jumps though. I do think the snake was the good was a good choice. Yeah. I think he uh, he made that uh, look a lot easier than mm -hmm. it probably was in his in, in his hands. Yeah.